I have finally unlocked DJ Benjamin, which happens to be Benjamin's hero alt. So we're going to be showcasing him for today's video. So without further ado, let's hop right into it. And of course, we have a fellow Darling Gunner user. I mean, we are in ranked, but we're still in Saraima Crucible, by the way, boys. And that's just because I really haven't been playing much of the game. I haven't really been trying to increase my trophy count, you know? So we're kind of just vibing in CC right now. We won't make a push for Hall of Masters 2 until very late within the season, okay? But this guy is also using Quinn no shot boys compare Quincy to DJ Benjamin DJ Benjamin is better in every way shape and form and I'm super excited to be using him for today's video okay we have technically used him before too um, back when we had early access for this new 1.2 update but besides that I haven't really used him since then so and I know he's pretty much almost entirely better uh, than normal Benjamin okay to compare the two the only thing with normal Benjamin is that he makes you a little bit more money but the difference in money is so insignificant because I remember when we had early access I was going against Asian sensation one of us was using DJ Ben and the other was using normal Ben and it was like round 26 and it was only like a thousand dollar difference between the two and that's not that much considering it's already round 26 you know that's pretty late into the game so one thousand dollars isn't really all that much and also too if you compare their abilities dj benjamin's abilities are just far superior okay so here we got a lot of greens i'm actually going to use the good vibes level three ability because this just absolutely shreds all these greens they will easily easily shred and there's only a one second cooldown on this ability versus normal benjamin there is a two second cooldown okay so we still ended up leaking lives i mean that's understandable whatever but let's finally go for the power for darts as well so the zero two two dart lane and now we should be absolutely vibing against all of these greens here our farm game is honestly not that good and that's because these rounds are ending super super quickly because look at our opponent's side that darling gunner is right at the front of the map popping all those ai balloons immediately um i guess we're not really popping popping them as quickly uh, but he is so these rounds are just freaking flying by but it's fine with me because he's going to pure eco strategy and also using dartling like dude i think dartling is really really good but not with pure eco strategies and what i mean by pure eco is his main money source will be coming from his eco that's why he's full setting yellows right here whereas with us we have farms so most of our money will be coming from our farms you know but we got three two zero zero farms for round nine here i'm not even gonna try to send him a rush right i kind of would like to go a little bit later with dj ben and hopefully Ouija over here ends up rushing us during these mid game rounds because I really would like to show off this good vibes ability it's called it's just like the level three ability uh with normal Benjamin okay the biohack but yeah we could maybe just maybe go um for a marketplace but I guess we'll play this safe here okay I'm gonna go for a hydro rocket pods here we don't even really need this dartling gunner either so let's sell that he completely stopped equaling by the way and I won't even send him a rush, although... Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. Let's send him some space lights. That will force the Hydro Rock Pods upgrade on his side. I guess I should have sent that right at the start of round 10, but it's really not that big of a deal, okay? And I really want to have minimal defenses here so that we incline Ouija over here to rush us, right? Because they do have the Hydro Rock Pods as well. So they must understand how um, not so good it is sometimes during mid-game rushes, all right? And we're going to be greeting absolutely so hard with our farm game, too. They ended up using the 032. Guys, use the 230. I'm telling you, the focus firing is much better in most situations, all right? Maybe like not on this map, though, but I'd rather have like more accurate aim because at the end of the day, if your rockets are missing, like that's obviously not a good thing. I could have went for this a long time ago, by the way, but it is fine. Now we're gonna save up about $8,000 in order to sell one of these marketplaces for a central market, okay? Oh, he's balloon boosting. He's balloon boosting. Look, 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 look. Watch, 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 watch. Okay, so I'm gonna go for the laser shock here and then I'm gonna end up using, oh wait. Oh my God. Okay, I've got a rocket storm this at least. I've got a rocket storm that at least. Okay, hopefully no cooldown, hopefully no cooldown. Dude, we shredded that though when we had that. Holy crap, guys. That was actually insane, all right? So we still need to go, though, for the central market here. We're going to keep the Rocket Storm on the map for that extra pierce because if you guys don't know, just upgrading to the Rocket Storm makes the Hydra Rocket Pods, like, significantly better. So if you end up actually upgrading to the Rocket Storm, don't sell it and rebuy it for a 230 because your opponent most likely will just rush you again, and you're going to end up losing a crap ton of money, all right? But that ability right there did shred. Um, I don't think, like, I think we needed a Rocket Storm there. I, I honestly didn't want to test the water, so 
That's why I just went for that. We had so much money if we just sold one farm. So it sucks that we had to do that, but it's fine. It's going to put us a little bit behind the farm game, but it's all good. This guy, by the way, Darlene A Spike Factory. Quite an interesting strategy, to say the least, my friend. We're, we're going to let him just sit there and vibe, right? He, he should be absolutely chilling, I think. And he could send us four to five mobs right now if he really wanted to. He's not even ecoing, by the way. Again, we're in a ranked game, boys. So I, I guess he just doesn't really understand how to fully eco. Or he was hoping for a quick and easy win with that rush. He's going to send us another rush right here. Although we have a rocket storm on the map. No shot, boys, all right? So we're just going to use this rocket storm. We don't even need to use the ability necessarily okay so oh my god we didn't even have to use that bro guys we didn't even have to use that that's insane oh my god rocket storm is actually freaking going to the right and this man over here look his darling gunner is constantly missing it's locked in place i think he should be able to defend that right oh my god he almost died he, he's not gonna die but he almost did jesus bro oh my god man you're gonna have to do something here very very soon my friend because it's not looking too good for you and we just got our wall street up here on round 22 so better late than never for sure but again he was a kind of aggressive uh towards us okay oh wait we're probably gonna have to do something about this oh for sure okay so let's just actually use a rocket storm holy crap holy crap holy crap oh my god okay 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 i'm gonna go for this uh vrf here kind of a risky play and I also am going to need a spike factor on the map because those fortified ceramics, they're absolutely no joke, boys. Holy. Oh, he's sending us a fortified ZOMG here, okay? So I forgot to tell y'all with the level 10 ability that you get with DJ Benjamin, it's called Beatdown. And it literally deranks every balloon on the map by one tier, okay? So it works up to BFBs. If there's BFBs on the map, it will turn them into mobs, okay? So that's a pretty big deal if you do ask me. Uh, by the way, are we fine? Okay, yeah, yeah. We're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, wait. Oh my god, we actually leaked down right there. Okay, so we just got to go for a few spike storms, by the way. Uh, sorry, I wasn't, like, really, like, thinking right there for a second. But but if we go for a few spike storms, we hopefully should be good. It kind of looks bad right now. But trust the process, all right? Because we're going to be using this beatdown ability, okay? So what I'm going to do is tower boost here. Use all these spike storms, all right? They're about to derank. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're going to wait until they derank into mobs. And then... Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Okay. All right, let's use this, this, this. Oh, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> easy claps, boys. You're joking. It's just too easy for us. A little bit of a cooldown, but again, only a one second cooldown. Although this guy's been quite aggressive, literally we've just been disintegrating his rushes because of DJ Benjamin, okay? So, yeah, he's just gonna surrender. He can't even compete. Literally surrendered because of DJ Benjamin. That is too freaking funny. All right, so this time we got the map of Castle Ruins. Of course, you already know, we're using the same exact strategy, and Castle Ruins is one of the better maps too that I personally like for this strategy specifically, okay? Because it's like a medium-sized map, so most games do not go that late, because if you really wanted to, too, you could anti-stall so hard on a map like this. You could have a Dartling gunner in place, like, right here, just popping those AI balloons right as they come out, but I guess we'll just play like this, right? Because a Dartling spot over here, like this one that we currently have, it's actually pretty good, if you do ask me, okay? And we could also go for DJ Ben, so let's just go for him all the way down here. I'm sure most of you already do know this, but make sure you place DJ Ben or regular Ben in pretty intense significant spots that are like kind of off the map or in corners all right because he doesn't like actually pop any balloons he's kind of just there to produce you money and also for his goaded abilities okay so let's just go for the faster barrel spin by the way too here Ooh, 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 ooh. joy didn't like that Jor did not like that. He was a little bit late, actually, to the faster barrel spin upgrade, which is why he ended up leaking down right there. But, I mean, he's going to be fine. He has Benjamin, so he's absolutely chilling, okay? But let's go for our first farm here. No way, too, that this guy's freaking... No way. No way. Okay, I'm going to send him space whites. He's farming, boys. He was full sending blues right there for a second. So let's use this ability, by the way, just so we can absolutely shred for a second. I'm going to go for the powerful darts here, too. Only a one-second cooldown once again, okay? So, dude, look at that. That's so good. And it's good to see that he's also using normal Benjamin, so we can kind of compare the two a little bit. I'm really hoping that this guy rushes us during the mid-game rounds. So again, I'm going to have very minimal defenses. So just really just a Hydra Rocket Pods, you know? We could send him a Yellow Rush here, which I kind of want to actually, okay? Um, I don't know if this is the play, but he just recently went for a farm. And this could force some upgrades on his side. Although, again, Darling is pretty good on this map. Yeah, it looks like he's going to go for another Darling Gunner. I can still kind of full send yellows here. Dude, look at that. 
He just shredded that, dude. Okay, that was not, absolutely not the play. Ooh, he's gonna be sending us some yellows, though. I'm not going for another dart lane. I don't even care. I don't even care, boys. Ooh, he's gonna do that. All right, so I'm just using DJ Benz. Ooh, okay, okay. I, I ended up tower boosting. I don't know if I needed to or not. That kind of sucks, man, because I honestly think I could have got away with not uh, tower boosting right there, but... It is what it is. We're currently out farming. I don't know why he would send us the yellow rush, but I guess it worked because we had to ultimately tower boost. So, well, well done with that. Let's send him some space leads here right at the start of round 10. You definitely want to make sure that you're sending those space leads too um, against a Benjamin user if they're using the Dartling Gunner because they have to go uh, for the Hydro Rocket Pots, okay? And so do we. So, this is kind of awkward. Uh, okay. Uh, let's go for this. Let's go for that. Perfection. Okay, so we're going to be leaking some lives here. Oh my god, dude. That really, really sucked right there. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Holy so. I'm gonna rebuild a farm here in hopes that he's going to be rushing me next round. No shot you went for that. No shot. Okay, I'm gonna have to rush him. I'm gonna have to rush him, boys, because he just went for a farm. Oh my god, he sold all three. He sold all three to go for a rocket storm. No shot, boys. Oh, it's not looking good for him. It is not looking good for him. So... We'll play this a little bit safer. I'm going to go for the laser shock as well on my Darling Gunner because now we're out farming him like crazy. He could sell this. Oh, wait, he's going to be rushing with purples. Okay, so I'm going to use DJ Ben's ability. DJ Ben's ability, go in for me. Go in for me. Easy. Easy glass and only a one second cooldown. So if he wants to rush me, <gasps> dude, he's in the same strat as me. Bro, we got to set my heart for that. That is litty, boys. Okay, so I am literally not even farming hard at all either. But this man, he is just screwed. Oh, he went for that. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? What the heck? Of course, I'm just going to go for a rocket storm. You're joking. You're joking. <laughs> He's literally just all hiding me, bro. What? <laughs> Why was that play, Jordan? No, 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 no. That was not the play. But I guess, hey, he tried his best, so GG's. That game ended up getting us into the hot pit, so let me know what you guys think about DJ Benjamin down in the comments below. And if you guys have not already, make sure to check out this video where I see if we can get every single fifth tier super monkey up in just one game.